The candy just freaking flew off the counter. I don't know. Key, ah! Ah! Wait, what the? No. You kill someone? <laughs> What's in here? It's like a Wi-Fi signal. I've got my entire family here. We've got Andropa, uh, my mom. I think my dad might be coming. We've got Sophie. We've got Tiffany. We've got Dan Dan here. And this is the perfect time to do a weird haunted house video. Now, we're going to try to convince them. Our house is haunted. Someone's whistling in the background. I don't know how to whistle. <sighs> Sounds like a fart. <laughs> okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to convince them that the house is haunted. And I was looking for the perfect opportunity to do this. And I, I kind of thought in the back of my mind, maybe this is the worst month because they're expecting it. Like these types of videos for Spooktober. But the last time Dan Dan came over, he was so freaked out because so many weird things happened that day. I don't even know. I mean, it wasn't that weird. We're not gonna be dramatic, but we kept kind of insinuating the house was haunted. So at first, something I had set up downstairs in the basement collapsed by itself. Nobody was in the basement. It all tumbled down. Honestly, probably a product of gravity and human error, but it still creeped out Dan Dan. Then later, I was setting up something and one of the studio lights bursted. The bulb bursted. I just want you to know yeah. this morning, me and Dan Dan, when we were making coffee, yeah. spilled water everywhere. It was the most bizarre thing. How? And I literally told him, be careful, it's another one of those days. So he's probably on the edge already. Okay, so <laughs> we're gonna try to convince them that the house is haunted. Dan Dan, I think, is the only one that might believe it. We have a couple things set up. We're gonna try to open the cabinets with fishing wire. You'll see, okay? You'll see it all. I don't think Andrew's gonna fall for it. He's really hard to like prank on stuff like this. Andrew's gonna scream like a little bit. <laughs> and then Dan Dan's like, it's just a cabinet, guys. <laughs> <laughs> you never know, okay? People change when they're scared, they change into completely different people. Did you know that we have a Small business, sir. Did you know that? Did you know we got a small business going up for Grandpa's art prints? Look, we have art prints. That's what you were writing the notes for. So Dan Dan was helping me write notes uh, along with Tiffany, okay? Yeah. Tiffany has been pulling through on all of this. We've been writing all of these cards for every order that we've been getting. And let me tell you, so much respect to small businesses. Okay, I know that small businesses were getting so much heat on TikTok because of like the whole like, if you can ever but like, wow, there is so much that goes into it that I never realized. Even just like the packing supplies, the process of packing. So I'm gonna show you guys how I pack an order because I feel like these are so satisfying to watch on TikTok and then I'm gonna show my whole family. Everyone's practically been helping, but this is Andropa's first time seeing this. Just a side note, they're all signed by Grandpa and I don't know what's been going on with Grandpa, but he's been busy. This man is so hard to get a hold of. So if you guys are getting your packages a teeny bit late, it's because grandpa will come over and freaking sign them. So we've got them all lined up. I'm gonna show you these that have been signed that I'm gonna pack for an order. We had this whole process. There was so much thought going into this. So we chose these tubes, these shipping tubes that are cardboard tubes instead of hard envelopes. And we chose this because apparently this protects the prints a lot more through like weathers, through different things. They also just protect just the crinkling of the print. Then we also put these into plastic so that if water or if something were to go through, there's no stains, there's nothing. We're just trying to prevent as many accidents as possible. So this is how it works. So you put a little butt on the tube. Got the sleeves. Look at me. We've been here and here. We've been trapped in Grandpa's factory, okay? This is actually an SOS call. This is a hostage situation, okay? Then they said to leave a little bit of room. You don't know how many packing YouTube tip videos I watched for art prints. And each one comes in this, okay? So that you can protect the print. I don't want anyone to get not a good print. And if you do, just email us, okay? We take off this part like this. So normally, some people put it into a hard envelope, but apparently that's nice originally, but the mailman, they'll like crunch it and then you don't want like a corner torn. So this is the best way to do it, is to roll so that when people get the prints, they can just put a book on top and it'll flatten out. And then in the middle, <laughs> we put in Dan Dan's handwritten card. Sometimes it's mine. If you're unlucky, you get Dan Dan's. If lucky, you get Tiffany's, okay? And then we do a little Sprout haircut. We're gonna play a Korean game. Yeah. yeah. Where? <laughs> Wait, what the heck? Hey, Tiffany, go there. Huh? Wait, what's wrong? No, no, go stand here. It's like a Wi Fi signal. Bitch! <laughs> 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 
They're saying guys don't look with eyes. Don't look. Guys look with their mouth. So the imagine like the wife, say, the girlfriend say, Hey Andrew, can you grab, grab me the spicy ketchup? And you're like, I don't see it. But then when the girl walks then, over, Oni's like, right fucking here. Yeah. Yes. I do that all the time. Yes. The whole point is you gotta prove it wrong. Yes. Like, it's not true. So who can find it first? So here's the, the challenge. Okay. We're gonna have you guys find spicy ketchup in that fridge. This is a joke, right? This is not a joke. Three, two, one, go. Spicy ketchup. It's gotta be spicy. Um, oh. Uh, Are you guys looking with your eyes? It could be on the top shelf. It can be on the very bottom shelf. You can move things around. Hold on. Dude, you guys what the heck? I mean, the color is supposed to be red. Yeah, no, it doesn't like have to be red. Why? It can be a very small bottle. Wait, what the fruit? Is this a head? Yeah, it's a head. No. <laughs> you kill someone? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, I'm supposed to be scared. Bro, you're gonna drop the water! Bro, you're gonna spill water! Bro, get out of the, get out of the fridge! It looks so real. It does. But the you guys didn't even flinch! The face though, it's, yeah. it's like a meme. Now, here's the real challenge. Oh, God. <laughs> Grab that. Grab it. Grab it. Now, Andrew, go ahead, open the top. I think something's gonna come out. Open it. Be careful. Uh, Hold it tight. Open it. Hold it tight. Don't drop it. I don't know. I'm kind of freaking out. <laughs> don't drop it. Now I want you to open it. Slowly. Slow. Um, oh my god. What the heck? <laughs> now bring it up higher. Higher. Closer to your face. Drink it. I'm not drinking it. Nah. Don't drink it. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> it's actually fruit punch. Really? Yeah. That's drink it. Okay, don't drink it. Oh. Wait, is there just so much hair? <laughs> don't drink it! Don't drink it! 
<laughs> You're really gonna drink that? Bro, were you trying to prank me from last time, Tiffany? What? It's Remember the cockroach? Why it's me? <laughs> this is really anticlimactic. <laughs> Plan B. We're gonna get into this one. I have to. Oof, I have to get in. Like, I know you guys don't want to see this. But I'm tossing all of these in, and then I'm gonna shake it up. I'm gonna shake it up good, just like this. Let's go. Yeah. This one's so good. <laughs> I already saw the video. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew, one of them is real in here. We all gotta die sometime, right? Okay, okay now it's like my life mission. Okay, at first I was a little sad that this video failed. Now, now the competitiveness has emerged. Now it's my freaking life mission before October 31st. Mark my words, before Halloween, before October 31st. I'm gonna make you cry in fear. Oh! Hey, so now, that, now, that no, fear. Sorry, now that we found out that she tried to prank us, good luck. No, no they got a good shoes. Oh, I'm gonna get you back. You be kidding me! Guys, we can't have our weakness show, okay? We're on the same team. So what is the team? We're, we're team, yes. right? Yes, and we're- Andrew? No, no. We're Damn it, why did Andrew see the video? You guys actually watch our videos? No. Oh. You want some? <laughs> this house is too fun. <laughs> I mean, I just spent the rest of my life torturing these three. <laughs> now, I can't really tell this story because I think Pete is gonna try to come for my sister, but it was a roach. If you love roaches, eat them for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, be my absolute guest, do whatever you want, you can have a whole field of roaches and have a good time, have a good time, <laughs> do whatever you want. But this is in the beginning when my sister had just first moved out. Now, nobody's first apartment is, nobody's, well, I guess some people, but nobody's real first apartment is like, you know, the king of all apartments. It's a pretty shitty apartment. So she had this problem where roaches would crawl out of the kitchen sink. This was when she was like a teenager and I was like a little kid. But roaches would crawl out of the kitchen sink and my sister got so used to the sight of it. One time she was doing dishes and there was a roach in the sink. She got so pissed, she grabbed the knife and beheaded it. Oh no! What? Well, I think she killed it first and then beheaded it. Did you it. know this? Did Andrew? you know this? And my mom and I were watching her Terrified. Really? So please be careful, Andrew. Have you noticed? <laughs> another, That's why my mom and I different. never fight back with her because we saw the roach beheading. We never say no to her anymore. I didn't know your sister was so. By the end of tonight, I will make at least one person cry. At least one. It's you. <laughs> it's either me or Tiffany, okay? So, guys, let me tell you what happened, huh? Do you see this string? Everyone sees the string. I'm supposed to. I put this string all the way over here, I hook it up onto this corner. I tied it around here so I can stand on the other side of the room and pull the string and the light is supposed to swing and you guys are supposed to go whoa did you see that the light is swinging is the house haunted okay Okay, so this was my view. The camera was right there. Yeah. He was behind the camera. You guys were doing the hand thing right here, right? right. I'm standing here looking and all I see past you guys is him going like this. <laughs> 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 like this, and I'm like, what the hell? And then he tried a cabinet one that snapped, and he's <gasps> like, then there, behind you. Oh, you're right, you're right. It's fake. <laughs> Don't break the no, light. No, when I first passed, remember, yeah, yeah, I remember we were like, I thought it was like, no, something like tingled or something, and so mm -hmm. I so you were freaking out. And then your sister, she goes, something's on my foot, and I was like, <laughs> just go. <laughs> I was like, just go. And then he said, he said, well, let me put this straight away. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who did that? <laughs> he, did. He, he said, there's a string and he put it on top. <laughs> okay guys, let me show you what else happened. You see this tree here? There's a string here. Oh. And then I forgot how heavy this tree was. So I was standing all the way over there, like really pulling this. <laughs> Nothing was happening. Okay, pull. Everybody pull. Pull. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that a ghost? <laughs> Did you guys see that? 
So we gotta move. We gotta go. We gotta go. And then I put a string over here too. And then I really forgot how tough these cabinet to open. <laughs> it's so heavy. I said, what are we gonna do if we pass by? I pull, no, I was pull the cabinet. So while you guys are talking, the cabinet just just swing open. Huh. Well, why? Why there's a string on tiger? Okay, explain why there's a string on <laughs> tiger. <laughs> Tiger's eating it. Dude, what are you doing? So disappointed in you, babe. Now, my mom's car has three rows, so pretty much almost every seat is jam-packed and it looks like my fiance is driving around. Literally a crew of kids. Tiffany's sitting in the middle row. We're back here. Hello. This is a whole conspiracy that my mom told me earlier today. The prices for candy get higher as you get closer to Halloween. For the procrastinators, there's less sales, but the early bird, they get the worm. So if we go now, maybe there's like a two for five. Maybe there's a three for 10, you know, type of deal. So that's what we're looking for. We need to stock up on Halloween candy. I thought because of, you know, what's been going on, maybe we're not gonna have trick or treaters, but every single time we drive out of the neighborhood, more and more houses are fully decked out. I'm I'm talking they've got graveyards in their front lawn. I'm talking 25 ghosts suspended from their big old trees. So I feel like there's probably gonna be trick-or-treaters. I feel like there's probably I'm gonna be a lot. Sure there will be. Yeah, so we gotta get a lot of candy. The last Halloween that we actually did trick-or-treating, my fiance gave literally every kid a whole bag of candy. I had a postmates candy because I was so scared our house was gonna get eggs in the middle of it. So Hundreds of dollars. Yeah, we, he spent hundreds of dollars on yeah. Halloween kids. The whole time he's like, I'm so annoyed. I hate Halloween. I can't believe these kids are gonna come. Oh my god, they're gonna be knocking on our door. I hate kids. But every time they would ring the doorbell, he'd be like, Babe, I got it. It's fine. You sit. And I <laughs> saw the way he was handing out the candy. I'm talking five fistfuls to each kid. One of the kids literally yelled so loud I could hear, This is the <laughs> and then he comes back and he sits down and he goes, did you hear that? This is the best house ever. <laughs> Handful. You just see their eyes like light up. <gasps> the crazy thing is, you guys know I overcompensate. So I had already bought like hundreds of dollars of candy, Bro, but we had to e order more. My ego was through the roof. Yeah. <laughs> so this egomaniac, we got to go buy him some Halloween candy for this year. Let's go to Target. Do we buy Sophie her first house all cash, no mortgage? <laughs> no. It's even got a $300. Yeah, we gotta take on mortgage. Yeah. Buy one, cost. get one, I told you from 10, 10 to 20. You guys 16. act like. Buy one, get one 25%. Okay, let's find the best ones and I will just get a, get a bunch. The best ones? Wait, get the ones on sale. Is everyone ignoring the sale stickers? Two for $5. But you also, maybe the party back is even cheaper. Ah. $15? 15 What? What's your favorite candy, Opa? Skittles. Skittles? Yeah. $10 for hey. 80 pieces. Yeah. This is $16 for 225 pieces. Holy shit. This, this, is, guys, this is supposed to be a fun pieces. target trip. Who turned this into math class? So let me rank it. If I got this in my bag, Starburst, yes. Starburst, yes. M&M's, yes. Snickers, mm. Three Musketeers, mm. Everything's good wait, except wait, wait. musketeers. So. Yeah. These are chocolate. Okay. Milky that. Way? Mm. Oh, yeah. It's so okay. Milky Way. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Everything's good. Oh. This, you guys think PCs. this is the best? This oh. is so boring. Are you Skittles? Lifesavers. Oh my god, that's so good. Oh, what, the hell is, what the hell is Lifesaver? Saves your life. <laughs> Bro. Honey, Sour Patch. Everybody loves Sour Patch. Do you, you like Sour Patch? Up? Yes. Mm -hmm. How much? $10. No, I think about it. Just put no, it I gotta think about it. <laughs> no, just put it in. Oh, I love these. Laffy Taffy. Oh, that's good. That's Which a good bag. Which one's going? This I love this. Bag. I will get two of these. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my god. god. <laughs> Are these good? Honey, you hate candy. You hate children. That's pretty popular. <laughs> it. It's all for his ego. This is an ego cart. Oh, these are my favorite. All right, I'll buy one for you, Bear. Oh, that's cute. That's really cute. Dan, Dan, you look so good. 116 on just Halloween candy. This is ridiculous. No, I'm looking at it. What if we don't have enough? I don't think we have enough. Oh my god. Oh, I don't know. That's funny. <laughs> I feel like we don't have enough, guys. This is so much. <laughs> Oops. Dana, you're the trick-or-treater. Knock on the door. Come here, Dana. I open it. Hello, trick-or-treat. What are you this year? Oh my god, it was so annoying. There would be 20 kids, he would ask each one, and what are you? <laughs> and what are you? And Anyone. then it was so awkward because you expect like, wow, you look good, right? He would just say, mm. 
What are you? That's like old grandpa. <laughs> what are you, Diane? What are you? Uh, uh, Tinkerbell. Okay. Okay, Tinkerbell. Oh. oh. Holy. Okay, that's good. That's about how much you would give. Oh okay. Just one kid? Let me show you how I give it, right? I like to give an assortment. Just a couple, right? So I would grab like a chocolate and then like this and like this. And yeah. I give it to him like that, right? He would go like this. Like dig his fingers in there and then just wow. keep going. The kids will wow. love it. Welcome to yeah. The kids will love it. So one Bro, day. If I was a kid and I, I got you, I would be the happiest man in the world. Okay, honey. Oh. What Halloween candy have you not tried yet in your life? I haven't tried half of these. Really? Have I ever had Whoppers? Bro, Whoppers are so good. These are boring. Whoppers with milk. What? Try that. I don't know. This doesn't look appetizing no, to me. No, it's not like No, it's no, just the whole thing. Is it sour? What's that face? Why are you not impressed? It seems like you don't like it. But he also doesn't like candy in general. Yeah, I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> you think it's a sour face. Ew, Ew. you're spitting it out on the seat? It's literally not even that sour. Hey, by the way, these are going viral in China. Twizzlers? Yeah. They call it like the LeBron James candy. Because he was chewing at it at the court and it got viral in China and people are taste testing it. Wait, oh my god, can I tell you guys something funny? You know how on YouTube you always see Americans trying a weird Asian snack? He showed me a Chinese app and it was a bunch of people going, Chinese try American snack. <laughs> and it was like Twizzler. LeBron and James they candy right are here. My feelings got hurt. They were like, it's okay, I don't know why Americans like it. <laughs> I was like, here's how you know that you came trick or treating at our house is because if you get no green sour patches, these are my favorite. No, that's my favorite. So I will be confiscating <laughs> all the green sour patches. Wait, should I take my favorite candy and take them away? Oh my god, we got these chips. Everybody's like tasting. Her dad's here to taste. Abba, really, taste it. It's really good. Hey, shit! <laughs> Where are you? I'm taking a home. What did he say? He just cussed. This guy doesn't know why I bought this. So this is a purse, but it's really only for one lipstick. It's a lipstick holder. Let me see. Lipstick holder. Yeah, I don't ever want to hear. Where's my lipstick, honey? Can you grab my lipstick, please? The only reason I'm vlogging this right now is because we had a whole debate about it. He's like, that's really useless, babe. You're not even going to put... And I was like, I can roll up cash in here. Uh huh. Yep. I can put one car here. key in here. Roll the cash. Give me the cash. Hi, honey. honey. <laughs> My hand can't get it. I can roll the cash in here. How badass is that? I just want you guys to know that I have a giant stag coming in on my left eye. So if you guys come in, I don't know, maybe like three <laughs> videos later, I may or may not be wearing sunglasses. Again, <laughs> because I don't know what's been going on since I moved here. You think there's cockroaches? What? Because I keep having dreams about cockroaches. What? And I keep having dreams about cockroaches and your sister said it might be because... No, someone told me. I don't know who said it. Someone told me. Ah, oh, this is so badass. I'm just saying, everyone needs a cash holder in their life, okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, enjoy sunglassless me. I'm just really disappointed that we didn't get to actually scare anyone today. My dad was pretty terrified. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.